So the historical novel. The historical novel is really important to me because I have a, a passion for history. And these books that describe what happened in the past, and sometimes it's maybe not completely true, but it presents a story of what might have happened, they're so important because it brings history to people in an entertaining way. And, it, and if you can, as a writer, if you can write a historical novel which asks questions and prompts people to go away and find out the truth for themselves, then I think you've served quite an important purpose for history. So, the 19th century. This is also an important period for me. I seem to have been drawn to it for some reason. Um, both the, the novel I've just written and the one that I'm writing now are set during that time. And for me, I feel I belong to that time a lot more than I do modern times. Um, everything seemed to be simpler in a way, and the clothes were so much better made, and I kind of feel uh, it's a time that um, we don't have anymore, and uh, that's why I'm really interested in trying to bring it back to life again and make it accessible to people. So, yeah. Paper. These are all related. <laughs> um, paper is something as well that belongs in the past. So, again, history, um, it's, it's something that we see disappearing. And um, it's very important to me to have a book. I always prefer an actual paper book. And books have such a personality, and um, they smell, and they feel, and you can have a relationship with a book. And I think in this world that we live in now, where everything's so digital and so fast and so on screen, paper is still important. And I, I hope that we keep it. Yeah. So, last novel. My last novel is actually my current novel, which is just coming out now. Um, so, that is, to sum up, based in the 19th century, and it's about artists, and about history, and some of the things that I've talked about. But so is my next uh, novel, which is about Alfred Nobel. And a lot of his life was based in Paris. So it's Paris, it's 19th century, it's Alfred Nobel, it's chemistry. Um, so. Yeah, I, I tend to have that as my genre and my topic. Uh, so that's my last novel. Cinema. Cinema is also really important to me because it's another way of um, bringing the past to the present. And because it's so visual, it allows people to connect in a short time and, and in a very easy way with the past and with the story. And I think it also with, with the technology that we do have, it's um, a very flexible way of storytelling and it brings it to so many people as well. So cinema is, is also close to my heart.